Welcome back to Dark Souls 2. You know the drill by now. Ah, uh, my name's Alex. Or Silvermont. Or tired Alex today. <laughs> um, whew. I, I did actually just wake up like a second ago and failed at hitting the stam dog. Arrgh. Right. <laughs> today we're gonna do. Well, you you know what we're gonna do, don't you? I'm gonna bust up these barrels first. Uh, yeah, today we're gonna do the Belfry Gargoyles. Gar gargoyles! I keep saying gargoyles! Picking up some weirder accent from somewhere. I blame Sweden entirely for this. Oh, right, I'm gonna get invaded, aren't I? Because I'm... Oh, unless I'm super quick. Damn, I never managed to hit with that attack. Um, uh, I guess we should clear this area out and get some items, shouldn't we? I probably should have woken up a bit before I started recording, but you'll get the joy of hearing me wake up as I play. No doubt. Whoa! Ow! 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 That really hurt. Jeez. Oh, poop. That's not good. Did, did I just deflect that by rolling at it? And we've been invaded? That's okay. I should probably try and summon someone, but... What, what rings am I actually using, even? Uh, you know what that will do. Oh, oh, oh. What happened? What happened? Oh, there he is. He's probably going to jump down here now, that he knows that I'm here. Ah, that works for me. Oop, missed. What's that? Oh, wow, how did that hit me? I'm pretty sure that didn't hit me. Yeah, I'm healing, I'm a scumbag, but what you gonna do? Oh, he's got some range there. Ah, I should probably... Ah, whatever. Damn. Oh, I got him anyway, somehow. Damn, he's got some crazy ass range there. Ugh. Ah, damn. Not really ready for invaders yet, I'm still too groggy. But that's okay. Oh, tell you what I will do, actually, I will swap weapons. I can't really use a um I can't really use a sway hander too well in there. It uh yeah. I that's actually the first time I really Oh, stupid dog. I only just made that sway hander and I was messing around in uh, heed with it. So I'm not really used to the moveset yet. I do know that it has a really awesome strong attack where you just prod people. Oh good, summon sign. Yeah, I might... Oh, I was going to say I might get rid of the summon but for the boss, but... I do like to have a summon sign just to get through this area, because... Well, when you get invaded by two people at once, it gets a bit frustrating, as I'm sure you know. Unless you like that sort of thing. Me, I'm not a fan of fighting two people at once. Unless I have a build specifically, you know, made for fighting two people at once. Not sure what that sort of build would be like in this game. Maybe... Hmm... Maybe, like, using Wrath of the Gods? I've only actually been hit by that once. 
I, I was running down here, some guy was like here, and he did it, one shot me, did like 1500 damage, I was like, whoa, what the hell. I didn't expect to be one shot by it, but it was the first time I've actually seen someone use Wrath of the Gods, Wrath of Gods, whatever. Apparently it's very strong, ow. <laughs> I'm playing really bad, aren't I? Ah, that's okay. Oh, look, a sign. Will it disappear by the time I get to it? Who knows? Um... I'm not even really sure what to talk about. I guess... Didn't I already talk to that guy? I think I did. Um... Not this guy, obviously. The, the little gnome man. This is the Tower of... It's the Tower of... Ven? Or Alkin? Let's go and check. Um, let me know how the audio is. I'm trying to adjust the volume so there's not such a huge gap between uh, my voice. Like, when I stop talking, the game volume obviously goes back to how it is. And when I start talking, the game volume goes down. You want to guard the bell, do you? For the prince and the... <laughs> mm, okay, I guess. Oh, be quiet. Enough of your words. Ah. Yeah. <laughs> so this is the t ah, this is the bell tower of Ven, Ven or Alkin, one of the two. Who cares? Ah, uh, there's quite a lot of lore around these two places. They have made these little mannequin people, who also, interestingly enough. These stupid little midgets. I really shouldn't have kept hitting then, because I've run out of stamina now, but... Damn, they hit really hard in... New Game Plus. Plus! Uh... Yeah, okay, might as well use... Why am I using this? I have no idea why I just did that. Oh, that's really slow. Damn. I'm not sure if, I, if I've ever used that spell before, but, well, whatever. <laughs> so, I went to the cinema yesterday to see The Raid 2. Awesome film, it's uh, Indonesian. If you like action films, then I would highly recommend it. It was awesome. Very violent, though, so if you're of a squeamish nature, you, you know, <laughs> might not want to do that. Lots of awesome getting hit by firebombs. Lots of awesome action scenes, really good car chase. Uh, it was a great movie. One of the best action movies I've seen in a long time. The first Raid movie is also really good. And also, apparently, there was someone from my high school working at the cinema that when I went up to the um, box office to buy my tickets, he was like, Hi Alex, it's me! And I... I had no idea who it was, which I feel kind of bad about. I was like, it's me, Patrick! And I was like, yeah. Uh, I don't know if I just have a bad memory or what, but I could not place him for the life of me. Right, let's um, let's do the bosses, shall we? Yeah, okay, let's go. Oh, what am I even doing? We'll use resonant weapon, of course. I struggle a little with these bosses. I should have buffed after I went through the gate. Oh. Damn. <laughs> he was trying to batter me then, wasn't he? Ow. Ow, ow, ow. Oh, right. You can't really stagger these guys, can you? Come on. Get, get. No. I'm so bad at this fight. I'm really terrible at it. I can't deal with these millions of enemies. Why are you flying off so far? Come back! Where, where are you going? Where is he? F where is he going? He's just... What? <laughs> what? It's not meant to happen. He literally just flew up into space. What the fuck? <laughs> what the hell? Oh god. Ow, 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 ow. Oh, why am I so terrible? How much is this going to do? Okay, not bad damage. 
Cause let me hit you. Let me stab you. Ah! What, what are you doing? Ow! Ow, ow, ow. Commence running. And chugging. Ah, trying to fiddle with my microphone mid-battle. Very, very easy, I'm sure. You will agree. Okay, Alex, you can do this. Stop spazzing. As I'm sure you've noticed, these are indeed gargoyles from... Ah! it's another one I forgot. <laughs> so many gargoyles. Please go. Please, all of you, just fly off like that other guy did. Is that gonna hit me? Voila. Get out of the way and let me kill that guy. You know what really sucks? You can't even use the yeah, sort of the um. Because in Dark Souls 1, this roof was more slanted, so you could kind of use the elevation to your advantage, if you were good. I like how they made one of the, I think, the easiest bosses, one of the easiest bosses. They've made it super, well, if not hard, then at least ridiculously frantic. Ah, God. Damn, I really wish you could stagger them, kind of. Ah! No! Nope. Ah, oh, this is- that was the perfect time to attack, damn it. They have some crazy-ass reach. Oh no, 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 you don't. Have a taste of this! Lightning Spears was the right choice, I think. Ah! Ah! Damn it! Okay. Okay, here we go. Gonna zap you out of the air. Nice! Kinda genuinely surprised I did that. I mean, I did, like, chug all the Estus in the world. Oh, Gold Serpent plus two. Very good. Very good indeed. Oh, that was that was stupid. Oh, Jesus! Ah, oh, I think I just had a heart attack. Ah! No, 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 no. No. <laughs> oh my God. Run. Oh god, that didn't really work, did it? Must bonfire. Ah! Oh, I missed. Oh. I hope that didn't deafen you. Sorry. I I did actually go. I was quite loud then. That that really frightened me then. Well, it startled me, I guess. I should have looked where I was going. I did not expect that. I just jumped out, and then the dogs were like, mm, I bite. Good lord. <laughs> oh, what a day. What a day. It's... Is there even more dogs now? They... I swear they've put even more dogs down there. Damn it, stupid ledge. Oh, come on, I know you can hit them. I've done it before. Come on. 
Damn it. Ah, uh, the invader's gonna come too. You know, let's just try and sweep through some of them. No, that that's not gonna work. Yeah, hi Dante's brother. Dante and Vogel. Vogel. Did I not? Oh, my, put my souls down there, you horrible game. You horrible game. I am not pleased. Damn it, how am I ever gonna do this? So maybe a witching urn, and I don't want to really... It's not a huge issue if I lose those souls, but I would rather not. You know? You know what I mean? So we're gonna put one of my 20,000 protection rings on. I really wish, I really do wish you could use items on a ladder. You can use Estus, so why can't you use other stuff? Come on, face the dog that's actually here. This guy's not too hard, but with the dogs on his side as well, that's when things get tricky. Die! Ah! Dogs! Dogs. Come on, Vorgil. Vorgel. Mm hmm. Stabbed. Come on, get up. I will stab you again. No, I won't. I tried to stab him, but it didn't work. He's got his shield out now. I wonder if I can bust his shield. Nope. Come on, block. Let me bust your shield away. Damn it, Vorgel. Stop being a... Stop being a douche. Uh, no. You... He has higher adaptability than I do too. Damn it, that's so annoying. Oh, I got him anyway? Arr, oh, he's gonna run down the ladder, isn't he? You are... Not being my friend today. Damn it. Damn it. Damn it. <laughs> See, sometimes I get really good parries, and other times I get... Oh, you. You. Fine. I'm going to teach you a lesson now. Where's your shield now? Shot you in the head. Come on! What's wrong, man? That's really not gonna save you, you know. Dickhead. Bastille key. Very good. Right, how long we've we been going? 20 minutes? But I have to cut out a few minutes of that because it was just me sitting there doing nothing. Uh, yeah, you know what we're gonna do? We're gonna go to my favourite NPC. Strayed. Um, I apologise if sometimes my words get cut off mid-sentence. That's because um, what I'm doing is I'm muting... I'm well, not muting, I'm turning my microphone on and off again after I speak. But sometimes I do it a bit too early. Because obviously there is a delay on the recording, like, if I say hello, it will not, you know, it will take a few seconds for it to come up on the recording. I don't know if that makes sense, I hope it does. Long story short, that's why sometimes my uh, words get cut off. I'm trying to get better at timing that, and obviously in the ideal, in an ideal world I wouldn't have to do that, but... Gravity. There's a little window down there. <laughs> yeah. So I, su I survive. I survive the gargoyles. I survive the the amazing ambush. 
and then I... <laughs> yeah, 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 then that happens. My amazing skill. Bust that door open. Where's my... Oh, right, yeah, no soul sign because I had the ring on. Come on. Stab you, stab you, stab you. We're getting a really good spell soon, I believe. Uh, it is one thing I kind of spoiled myself on. I know where this spell comes from. Oh, really? The range on your thing is bigger than... I don't know. The entire universe, maybe? Dark Claymore. You're still alive, and now you ain't. I might as well keep my witching ends equipped. This is, if you remember, way from a much earlier part where it was I was spamming soul vortex on those uh, little explodey men. Where are we now? Ah, uh, yeah, this place. Hate these enemies. Don't like them. Fortunately, they are weak, and I think they got nerfed in the recent patch. The I say recent, the patch was ages ago by the time this goes live, but you know what I mean. La 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 la, so I'm gonna shoot you in your head. Love this bow, it's so cool. There's more in these things here. Uh, is there anything in here? Yes, there is. You know what, I might as well do that little side area quickly. Why not? It's this. Just a little pointless area, I guess. Hopefully there won't be any horrible new enemy spawns here. Didn't actually find. It took me quite a while to find because I, I, I missed it, and then I at some point I saw this item here, and I was like, "How do you get that?" And that's when I started exploring. That's really good level design when they show you something, and it's sort of you know you have to explore to find it. I like that bracing knuckle ring. Right, let's read the description of that, I suppose. It's actually quite useful. Uh, knuckle ring worn by Roy, Roy the Explorer. Slows equipment degradation. Expensive flashy gear will not always make life easier for you. Um, sometimes it's best to, like, use your reliable stuff. Yeah, I fell off a ledge then. <laughs> That's more or less what it's saying, though. Mm, much strength. Boys! Damn, I thought I might lucky headshot him. Damn. Glug, glug. Chug, chug. Radiant life gem times eight. Wow, that's, that's quite a lot. Now, this bonfire right above me and that bonfire over there, I don't like either of these because they both have enemies right next to them. At least I can one-shot these guys, I'm very happy about that. Oh, wait, do I even have a branch of your... Oh, I hope... Oh, good. Phew, I should have checked that before, shouldn't I? And here's my favourite NPC in the game. Strayed of Olafis, or Ulafi, however you want to pronounce that, I'm not sure. Maybe he'll tell us. I don't think he does, but that would be nice. I wish he would say, I am straight, or blah, so I don't have to keep pronouncing it. No doubt, in what is a wrong way. I think this is just a pointless shortcut thing. But, let's see what he's got to say. My favourite NPC. He's so badass. 
<laughs> Still a bit stiff, I'm afraid. <laughs> I must thank you, young traveler. I am strayed. A wandering sorcerer of sorts. I've been a guest for a very long time. But I don't think that anybody will miss me. <laughs> mm -hmm. Very good. Very good indeed. Cursed one, weak you may be, but I, strayed, will teach you my spells. A ring used long, long ago, in a land that existed where Drang Lake does now. A ring used long ago, not created. That doesn't... I don't really think that's good evidence for Vinheim. Yeah, it, it might... It is some... Tangent... Tangent... Oh my god. Tangential... Whatever, I can't pronounce anything today. It is a little bit of evidence, but I believe when it says used, we know it was used in Lordran. We don't know it was used in Vinheim, although it probably was because it was created there. Just saying. The High Priest of Volgan. The clerics of the great city of Volgan are perennially entrenched in scandalous power struggles, but among them remains a few strong-willed, upstanding noblemen. Volgan almost makes me think about the Vatican. <laughs> Vatican City. Uh, he sells lots of good stuff. F another flame swathe. Whoosh, swathe. Swoosh, swoosh. I think I've got all of these. Yeah, I... Yeah, cool. Let's see what we can trade with him. Lots of crap. Do I... What do I have? Oh, I don't actually have Blinding Bolt. Because, of course, very good. I need that. I think those are like the last two miracles I need. i pretty sure I have that. I wish it would tell you if you have these spells already. I'm fairly certain I do, but... Blinding Bolt... A miracle that creates a giant soul mass and transforms it into a lightning-spouting orb of light. Crafted in ancient times by the god of sun, but later forbidden by the same deity. Or deity, whatever. Was it... Was it to protect the world from hatred or sorrow? Trade for this item. Um... Yes, because I want the achievement. Um... Strayed is basically a master sorcerer. He makes pyromancies, he makes hex... I think he makes hexes. Does he make hexes? I'm pretty sure he... Well, he sells hexes. Hmm. Well, maybe he didn't make them, but I think he uses them. Yeah, he, he, make, he made a lot of really powerful sorceries and pyromancies. See? Made by Strayed, made by Strayed... And made by Strayed. He's he's pretty much badass wizard man. This is what he has to say. Oh, how long was I sat petrified? Long enough for the old kingdom to have crumbled, I see. Why didn't anyone wake me sooner? <laughs> I've never heard the name. Is that what they call this place now? Very good. <laughs> Very good indeed. The cursed ones were imprisoned within this land. Of course, you came of your own free will. <laughs> The people feared the Cursed Ones like a plague. Some people would rather keep dreadful things out of sight, out of mind. In the end, they swept them up and corralled them here. So very typical of meek minds, don't you think? <laughs> Once people became aware of their own frailty, they seized anybody they found undesirable, 
cursed or no, and impounded them here. Whoever posed even the slightest threat was removed, all so that they could sleep better at night. They even turned the great strayed into a stone. <laughs> Many kingdoms rose and fell on this tract of earth. Mine was by no means the first. Anything that has a beginning also has an end. No flame, however brittle, does not one day splutter and fade. But then, from the ashes, the flame reignites and a new kingdom is born, sporting a new face. It is all a curse. <laughs> and it is your cursed flesh that will inherit the flame. <laughs> Pyromancy was created by the ancient witch of fire. She harnessed the power of flame and melded it into pyromancy. The witch led her daughters into war against the Old Ones. But legends are legends. What are you prepared to believe? <laughs> oh, lo Feeble, cursed one. Do you really think you can manage the glories that are my spells? <laughs> well, the most interesting thing, I believe... Well, okay, one thing that's interesting. He mentions the witch, uh, the witch of Isolith led her daughters into battle against the Old Ones. Now, that would imply that the Old Ones are the dragons. But according to this game, the Old Ones are actually the Lord Souls themselves, the Witch of Isolith, uh, Gwyn, Seath, and Nito. Don't you find that interesting? It's like, they thought the Old Ones were the dragons, but now the Old Ones are the ones who killed the dragons, or who knows, maybe they're both Old Ones. It's really, it's really cool. He also gives a lot of pretty heavy hints that Drang Lake is indeed where Lordran once was. And he mentions that this place, this this Bastille, it used to be just for the the undead, but eventually they just started locking everyone up here who they didn't really like. Really shows how the the purpose of this place has changed over time. Whether or not it was the undead asylum or a undead asylum, I really like that because you know, asylum is it's where you put people who are you know, suffering from mental problems and stuff. And, you know, it, w it was for their own good. You just lock the undead up so, you know, they can pose no trouble. But then eventually it becomes this place, a huge fortress to imprison and torment many poor souls. Anyway, that's going to do it for today. Um, yeah. <laughs> I'll see you guys tomorrow, probably. <laughs> Unless it's Friday, in which case I'll see you on Monday. Goodbye. Take care, have fun, all that. Ciao. Commentary yet. Oh well, whatever. I'll just have to heal her. That's why I have my heal miracle equipped. These guys are probably gonna want Oh Fuck. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs>